Welcome back to another Shamshir Sound video. In this tutorial, we'll review how to install custom fonts inside of Zgame Editor using FL Studio 21. If you guys are enjoying these quick videos, remember to smash up the like button and let's get started. We're using HUD text inside of Zgame and the reason why we're using this is because it's a lot more powerful than the other typical legacy plugins. And this is found under HUD, HUD text. One thing to keep in mind is add some lines of text in preparation. And you can find that under add content. Generally, what I like to do is I make a few extra lines in addition to what I have if I'm doing a lyrical video, a hype video, a promotion, so that I have some reserved when I automate the text line. But that deserves its own video where we'll go more in depth using HUD text. Now that you've added some lines of text over on main, we can see so many controls, but let's focus on font. We can see a great list of options under font to use already that come with Zgame. Let's go ahead and start installing some custom fonts. You're going to want to navigate to your fonts folder. So I installed FL Studio 21 right to my C drive. So I navigated to C, FL Studio 21, plugins, fruity, effects, Zgame Editor Visualizer, Effects, HUD, Fonts. And you'll see there's a lot of TTF files here. So all you need to do is go to your favorite fonts website. In this case, we'll use Google Fonts, download the TTF file, and go ahead, extract that content, take that TTF file or files, and throw them in this folder. I went ahead and downloaded Bebas from Google, and all I'm going to do is I'm going to copy this and paste it in that folder. We can now see that it's been placed here. We don't see the new font here yet. Let's go ahead and restart FL Studio. With FL Studio restarted, we can now see Bebas, the new font that we just installed, ready to be used. I really love HUD text. One reason being that I can add these custom fonts, but also the amount of automation that can be done and effects that can be applied to text. So try it out. Try installing some custom fonts. If you guys enjoyed this video, remember to smash up the like button. If you're new to the channel, smash the subscribe button, hit that notification bell, and that way you're alerted of the daily uploads. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a great day.